Hey, what up, Z Clan, and everybody else? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 video. In this video, we're going to be reviewing Graham's Green Bundle. So, I'm going to be acquiring it and uh, making a full review of the items that are included within the bundle. So, let's not wasting time. Jump right into it. Alright, so before I buy the bundle, let's quickly uh, take a look at the bundle description and what it includes, and then now I'm going to acquire it and start showing it to you step by step. So essentially, this bundle includes the Super Mutant Backpack, which you can see on the screenshot right here. I'm actually curious to know about if those things that are next to the helmet are going to be sticking out if you're going to be in the first person, so that's the first thing I'm going to be trying out. Uh, then we got the Graham Plushie. Uh, so that's the plushie right there. Uh, we got the green menace frame. That's uh, the photo frame right here. Uh, what else we got? The super mutant helmet and the super mutant uh, outfit, as we can see on this screenshot right here. So let's go ahead and uh, acquire the bundle. There we go. We bought the bundle and everything has come came with it. Now, uh, the first thing is, let's take a look at the player icon, which is located at the icon section, and it's the very first one, and I'm surprised that it's uh, not auto-selected, so I'm going to go ahead and auto-select it. Now we're going to move out, and I'm going to be creating, uh, uh, actually you can see the icon on the top right, very right corner. Uh, but I can also create a team or just join and we should see the player I can pop in pop in Really? Oh, there we go <laughs> uh, so You should see it on the bottom left corner right there next to gamer Z Solve file 199 Oh That's all right for a player I can <laughs> Let's take a look at that framework. So, in order for that to work, we need to go to the uh, photo mode and let's find it. All right, so you can find the green menace uh, in the standard category, and uh, you'll just need to scroll through because you might have some others, right? So, if you scroll through, you will essentially at some point end up uh, finding it and making a screenshot. <laughs> Alright, so the plushie we can find uh, at the floor decor section and uh, you'll need to find your first plushie that you have uh, in your build menu. For me it's uh, this cow right here. <laughs> uh, then you'll just scroll through all the plushies that you already own and uh, neither through the atomic shop, neither you uh, got it as a plan uh, from an event or whatever, whichever I can't really recall where, or yeah, events. Yeah, those are where events. And uh, essentially, you will find your dude. So there you go. You can see him right here. He's actually uh, a pretty big plushie, man. Let's move him somewhere right here. So it's big. Good thing to have for a collection. If you like collecting these things, maybe definitely you want to grab it, or as an individual use. Let's see how the outfit and the backpack looks like and uh, then I'm going to give some explanation in regards to uh, the entire bundle. Anyway, so we'll need to go to our work armor workbench. So to start off, let's do the outfit. So we're going to be t uh, looking for the head aware and the outfit. So let's start with the head aware. In order to find it, if you have a lot of items, you'll just need to go to the letter S first for Sam and uh, find super mutant helmet there we go make that one then outfits uh, i assume it should be letter s as well super mutant outfit there you go now in regards to the backpack you can either create a new one with the skin or uh, change your uh, armor workbench to modify afterwards navigate to your backpack uh, select the mod that you want to apply it. and once again I believe we'll need to navigate to the letter S to find the super mutant backpack there we go so we got the backpack and let's move out of here okay I'm already in the first person so these things are not sticking out actually it's not bad 
Uh, let's go ahead and go to the Pearl and uh, put on the out. Oh man, this is actually not that bad. Phew. You know what? Uh, let me go to a section where there's more light. Alright, so we went to the vault because there's no uh, daytime at the moment, and this is our outfit. So let's use the Photoshop, I mean the Photoshop, the photo mode to get into it. Uh, you can see on the screen right there, it looks okay. Alright, so we can review it like this. So, man, well, <laughs> uh, I wonder... It, do I see the naked stuff because I don't have an under armor turned on? Oh no, I do have it on. Okay. Oh wait, this is an outfit, this is not an armor. Well, I don't really like that the body is sticking out, to be honest. I, I do like the helmet. Ah, check this out, lol. It actually, you can wear your eye patch and your gas mask. <laughs> Lol, I just noticed it, man. I was thinking it was part of the thing, but... Lol. There you go. Okay. That's actually pretty cool. I mean... You can put on some goggles and it should work pretty cool. Ooh. I have ideas coming in. So, honestly, I really dislike that the body is showing. Unless if we we're going to get some super mutant skins and you will be able to transform yourself into a B.I.G. super mutant and play as a super mutant. That would be cool. But on a human body, man, this don't look good. <laughs> I don't like. I mean, the armor is big. It's, it's cool. I wish it would be covered with, I mean, the body parts would be covered with something. But right now it's just like, uh, I don't know, like a naked dude covered with a whole bunch of freaking stuff. Uh, but uh, the outfit itself looks to be all right. I mean, the only minus for me that I dislike is the body show. But the armor itself is actually pretty cool. We got the skulls, we got the metal pieces, we got some nails over there with the metal. We got we got a lot of good stuff. I like the shoulder with the spike turned out and the arm. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Yeah. And uh, that's the backpack. The backpack actually is pretty dope. I didn't expect the backpack to be so cool. Uh, I didn't actually want to buy it in the first place, but uh, thanks to your suggestions in the comments on Tuesday, uh, I decided to, you know what, let's go ahead and get it. And the backpack is actually pretty cool. That I admit. Now, here's the thing. I'm curious. Uh, boom. Even the helmet on its own looks nice without that uh, outfit. Backpack also suits this outfit, but we do have a whole bunch of other outfits. And what I really, really want to uh, try out right now, I think I have the most default goggles, one of my favorite in the game. I use it a lot. These ones right here. Let's see how that's going to look if I if it works. Boom. There you go. It works. <laughs> now, that looks dope. Man, I'm already thinking of different types of combos you can make with this specific uh, outfit. I mean, even the Raider uh, mask, it sticks out through the helmet, as you can see, but it actually looks cool. <laughs> it actually looks cool. So, yeah. I think this is the perfect uh, like uh, combo for the head. Now for the armor, let's see what I got here in terms of... I think you already got the point about the bundle, right? Uh, I think I didn't miss anything, did I? Let me just double check real quick. Ah, Kukuroch, the bundle has disappeared. Uh, but yeah, I've shown everything that it includes because you can see it all here. Uh, yeah. Dang it. Alright, I think the Raider outfit should look good with this. Let's check out what, what we got here. I'm gonna make a few of them. How about the Caravan Trader? One of my favorite, favorite, favorite ones. The Elite Ranger. Let's try that out. Uh, 
then what else we can try it out with? Let's try it out with the King Ragnog outfit. See how it's gonna look like. What else do we have here? Then we can try it out. Uh, the Raider Pathfinder. The Raider Scrabber. By the way, Pathfinder is from a bundle of for when the Wastelanders came out, and I believe they took it off the stores for some reason. I have no idea why, and I have no idea if they will be returning that, but they should. Uh, this is Super Mutant, the Quack outfit. No, I don't think I don't really like the Quack outfit to be honest. Sub Juggernaut. Let's try that one out. Let's try this one out as well. Waste Trapper. West Virginia Drifter. That's it. Let's see how those gonna look like. Boom. Okay. That is actually pretty cool. Mm-hmm. I like it. Yes, sir. Let's see what else we got. Oh, that might be even better. Yeah, this looks even better. Definitely way better. This one's from the Atomic Shop. Uh, Wasteland Eye Patch, no. Superman, this one. Uh, it's alright, I guess. It's actually looking good, too. It matches with the red colors and stuff like that. The helmet looks dope. Actually, pretty cool. <laughs> Damn, there's a lot of good outfits that actually match with that helmet and uh, everything else. This, it's this one is super super like dark dark, right? So if we were to be able to color the helmet and make it dark, that should look really nice. If we would have the capabilities of painting our own outfits, that would be even better. Uh, so a little side note over there, I would really love to paint the that red part of the backpack into more dark color and we could make a really good uh, combo out of that one Wastelander Trapper also Atomic Shop yeah looks looks good yeah looks good ooh yes this is actually looks even better covers Yes, sir. Look at that. And this is the Atomic Shop version. Uh, we do have a, a regular version that you can acquire by with a small chance of drop by doing the uh, riding shotgun. It, you can trigger the quest at the uh, Big Bend Tunnel East, and there's a chance that you can drop it. Let me see if I have one. I, I should have one. Uh, a whole bunch of. Uh, Outfits. Choo, 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 choo. Let me see if I have it. Man, I gotta get rid of all those extra bags that I have. But yeah, you can make a, a lot of decent combos with that helmet. I I'm actually very. <laughs> I, to be honest, personally, I was thinking that helmet wouldn't be good, but it is good. Oh, there we go. Oh no, that's that's not the one. Where? What the hell happened to my? I I know I had it. Don't tell me I lost it. I'm like a hundred percent certain I had it. Well, that sucks. I'll need to regrind it then. Or was it a plan? I don't remember. Oh no, blue, blue, blue. There we go. Blue Ridge Caron outfit. There you go. Just forgot the name of it. All right, there we go. And let's check it out. Actually, this one is looking better. Yeah, this one is way better. Haha. <laughs> I think this is uh, how I'm gonna be running around for the next one. 
for the next few times. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think I've skipped some outfits. This is the uh, caravan trader outfit. Also looks good, but this caravan trader outfit, man, it matches a lot of different uh, outfits, and and it still looks good. But I think I'm gonna stick with the Blue Ridge because I haven't been using it a lot, even though I got it. Ooh, the elite one is actually also looking nice. Ah, come on, man. Yeah, it's actually also looking pretty cool. Well, not the best, but still. It's alright. Something we can work with. <laughs> but yeah, I think my one that I... Ah, oh, wait, we, I've missed this one. And once again, I don't like that the body parts are sticking out. And... Nah. Nah. Mm -mm. I ain't even gonna destroy that one. Boom. Uh, so yeah, what do you think is the best one to work with in this case? With the uh, with the helmet, and what do you think is the best outfit? I mean, the Super Mutant outfit, yeah, is alright, but I would start using it probably if we'll be able to have, like, to play as a Super Mutant. I hope that's going to be one of the possible features in the future, future, future to come. Uh, but for now, I think I'll stick with this combo right here. But looking forward to your comments. What do you think is the best uh, outfit to combine it with the helmet? And before I end the video, by the way, I did forget about the trinkets uh, for the backpack. So the trinket location are right over here. So I placed the, the two... Uh, Red Rocket Trinkets, I have the skull as well, but it's not fitting as, as great. And yeah, so the trinkets are there, actually pretty cool. Uh, but I would prefer maybe on top or somewhere else, because they are like kind of barely visible. If you don't know, by the way, how to apply the trinkets, you will need, once again, the armor and workbench. Then you navigate to your backpack, and then you just put the trinket that you want to use. That's it. There you go, you can see it right here. Ah, I don't have the skull, I have the armor ace uh, helmet. Actually, whatever, let's have two different trinkets. Who, who cares? <laughs> Alright, well, uh, this is pretty much it for the review. The bundle is pretty alright. Um, maybe worthwhile of waiting for some discounts to come for specific items to make it even more discounter. Or maybe even buy them individually. Uh, with disc but waiting for discounts because I haven't seen bundles coming with discounts for a while now I don't think that's that's gonna be a thing anymore but I might be wrong but anyway I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did you know the drill don't forget to hit that like comment down below please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube nobody see them nobody can read them nobody can respond to them so if you got something to say feel free to comment the only thing that I ask of you is not to swear so if you're not going to swear, people will be able to read your comments and respond to your comments if they feel like to do so. Uh, same goes for me. <laughs> but if you will swear, I'll just delete the comment. If you push it, you'll get banned. Simple as that. If you're new and subscribe, well, welcome to Z-Client. I'm Gamer Z Solo from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Once again, if you want to join our Discord, feel free to do so. We're over 850 members over there, but once joining, make sure to read our rules. Otherwise, it's probably going to get banned by me or by my mods. We are strict, so don't play with us. And uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. All of the useful links are down in the video description. And I'm looking forward to your feedback as well down in the comments. The more feedback, the better for other people to make a, a choice whether this is something they want to get or not. Because we all know the prices are overpriced, the atoms are very hard to make, and, and so on. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. Bye. From the ashes we rose into